Uh, this is 2022 KCSE Mathematics Paper 2, question number 18. Two bags P and Q contains identical marbles except for the colors. Big bag P contains three greens and four red marbles. Uh, bag Q contains two green and three red marbles. Uh, part A. Find the probability of picking a red marble from bag P. So if you look at bag P, uh, you can write it here. It has uh, three green marbles and four red marbles. So it has a total of seven marbles. So the probability of uh, picking uh, a red marble from that bag, uh, okay, first we can say Q contains uh, two green and uh, three red marbles. So the probability of picking a red marble from bag P is equal to the number of red uh, marbles in that bag you divide by the total. So it is 4 over 7. So that is a probability. Uh, part B, the marbles were picked at random from bag P one at a time without replacement. Draw a probability diagram, three diagram, to show all the possible outcomes. So this is how we draw the three diagram. We say that is a say that is the first pick. So the first pick you can take either a green or a red marble. Uh, bag P has three green marbles. So the probability of picking a red a green marble is three. The number of green marbles in that bag over the total number of uh, uh, marbles in that. The probability of picking red, we say we have four mar red marbles and the total is seven. Uh, we come to the second pick. You can either take green or you can take a red one. Uh, so if we had taken a green one, then it means that uh, two are remaining and because we are not re uh, replacing, uh, it means the total number has reduced by one. So we have 2 over 6. Uh, if we take a green one, the probability of picking a red, we, the red uh, marbles still remain uh, 4, so it is 4, but the total number has reduced uh, by 1, so we have 4 over 6. We come to the other option. You can take a, a green marble or a red marble. If you had taken a red marble, uh, the, there is a pro, the, it means that the number of green marbles remain the same so it is 3 out of 6 because we are saying that the total number has reduced by 1 because we are not replacing uh, then we have if you pick a red it means since we had 4 the number of red uh, marbles has reduced by 1 so it is 4 uh, 3 that is and the total number has reduced by one because we are not replacing so that is a three diagram that is uh, expected and by doing that then you'll be able to score one mark uh, roman number two find the probability that the two marbles picked were of the same color so if you look at this it is either we take a green and a green so we say it is green and a green uh, here we take green and r uh, green R. Uh, here we take uh, red and green and here we take uh, red and red so the prob there are only two options where we can have uh, the marbles being of the same color so the probability of picking uh, uh, picking marbles of the same color is a probability of picking either a green and a green or that is this is or uh, a red and a red so this we take the probability the probability of picking a green is uh, 3 over 7 you multiply by the probability of picking a green again which is the same one two over six is the same as that you can simplify there then you add uh, you can separate here we add the red the picking a red and a red so it is a uh, 4 over 7 you multiply 
uh, 3 over 6 is the same as a half uh, so you can compute that and you'll be able to get uh, the probability when you can simplify 3 cancel 3 or can uh, uh, cancel 3 so here we have 1 over 7 uh, divide by 2 divide by 2 you get 2 so here we have 1 over 7 and 2 over 7 so we have 3 over 7 that is the probability that you pick uh, two marbles of the same color we go to roman number three find the probability that at least one lead marble was picked uh, if you look here it is a uh, uh, we only have one option here where we have a green and a green otherwise the rest of the three uh they are they are they are we have a red marble here we have one here we have one and here we have one and we are told at least one uh, so what you do is uh, you can you can calculate the probability of picking uh, a green and a red the probability of picking a red and a green the probability of red, red, getting a red and a red alternatively you can say probability uh, at least list a uh, red marble is equals to we say it is one minus the probability of not taking a green marble so which is a uh, which is a uh, three over uh three over seven you multiply by uh two over seven this is equal that not two over seven so for that two over as uh, two over six which you have said is the same as uh is the same as one over so you find that you give you uh, 1 minus you you can simplify here uh, by 3 you get 1 uh, so this is 1 minus 1 over 7 uh, 1 over 7 which will give you 6 over 7 so that is a bit easier uh, co compared to the other option but you still see get the same answer uh, so we come to part c the marbles picked from bag b in b were both put into bag q uh, a marble was picked a marble was then picked at random from bag q calculate the probability that the marble picked was a uh, green in color red in color uh, so we can use uh, the tree diagram to help us uh, uh, be able to solve this. Uh, so let me we, we draw. We see these are the marbles that were picked from bag B. So we can represent that using uh, using a tree diagram and say uh, here we have said it is uh, we can take a green or a red marble and we have said this is three over seven and this is 4 over 7 uh, the second uh, pick we have uh, we have said you have taken a green and a red one here now we can say it is a that we can simplify that and here it is 2 over 3 2 over 3 uh, so the third pick now these two marbles were put in bag Q so it means if we have taken a green and a green uh, then we have uh, four green and three red. So the probability of uh, the probability of picking a green, the green will become four, and the total number will be seven. So it is four over seven. That is when you put uh, the two marbles which you have picked in bag Q. If you pick a green and a green, it means uh, that will be four greens and three red. So the probability of picking a red is Three red. We have three red, and the total number is seven. So that is how you work out that. We get the, this one, uh, and we say the probability of green or you get a uh, red. Uh, so if you look at this uh, this route, you take a green and a red. So it means when you put them, we have added one one. So the probability of so the green will be three, uh, and the red will be four. So the probability of picking a green will be 3 over 7. You can write that, uh, uh, that is 3, uh, let's put that properly. So it is 3 out of 7. 
uh, here we have added one so it is four out of seven so we are through that with that we come to the second uh, here we have we had we have here what we have uh, picked there uh, so we the, the probability of uh, picking a, a green one and there is a probability of picking a red one and we have them here we can simplify this is the same as a half that is two th three over six is a half and uh, three over six is a half again uh, is a half not that third is a half now we come now we come to the now when we pick these two we put them in bag uh, bag uh, in bag q so we say uh, we have this you can pick a green or a red now because we have taken a, a red and a green it means we have added one one so green becomes three and uh, red become four so the probability of picking a green is three over seven the probability of picking a red is four over seven then finally we have this pick uh, that is the probability of pick you can pick a green or a red one uh, so the pro if you pick a red and a red it means when you add here you get five reds uh, out of seven because now five plus two is seven and uh, maybe let's put it uh, properly there so here you get uh, five out of seven and if you if you pick a red and a red you you add you get five so the probability of picking a green is two over seven so that is a that three diagram is going to help us be able to solve uh, these questions down here uh, so what is the probability that you pick a green color a, a, a marble uh, was picked green in color so we can see here uh, we have uh, this is a green uh, this is green uh, this is also green and this is green so those are the options where we can pick a green marble uh, so what we do is uh, we, are, we calculate the option uh, probability that you pick a green so uh, to get that because of space I will not be able to uh, to work but uh, to, to, to put all the probability but you multiply so the first option is this one you go that way uh, let me use a let me use a line here uh, so you go this is uh, uh, that probability uh, it does make it uh, a bit bigger so that is a probability uh, you get this one uh, you get that one so you get a green so you multiply uh, 3 mod over 7 multiply by that multiply by 4 over 7 and when you do that you will be able to get 4 over uh, 49 then you add the other option is this one uh, you, you the same root but now you junction here that one uh, that one so you multiply 3 over 7 multiply by 2 over 3 multiply by multiply by uh, 3 over 7 and when you do that you'll be able to get 6 over 49 uh, then plus the other option is uh, uh, this green here so you follow this root you go this root and you go this route so you multiply 4 over 7 multiply by a half multiply by 3 over 7 and when you do that you will be able to get uh, 6 over 49 and then you have a, a plus the other the other option is this option this follow this uh, you follow here and you follow here so you multiply uh, 7 over 4 over 7 multiply by a half multiply by 2 over 7 and you'll be able to get uh, when you do that you'll be able to get 4 out of 49 uh, when you add up this then you get the probability is equals to 20 over 49 so that is how you uh, get the probability of picking a green one um, the other one is a uh, probability that uh, you pick 
a, a red color. So the red color, then you can say it is a probability, one minus, uh, so you can say that is a probability, uh, so this is uh, Roman number two, probability of uh, picking a red is equals to one minus probability of picking a red one, of picking a green. So that will be 20 over 49, and that probability will be 29 over 29 over 49. So that is how you get the probability of picking a red marble. So that's how we go about this question. Uh, I hope you have followed. You did this in Form 3, uh, the topic of probability. Uh, so that's the, pro that's the way you handle that.